Is it a fair expectation to see a clear pathway towards a World Cup? I always believe in, in, yes, in the team. It's a World Cup. I always believe. True friendship. <laughs> Podolski takes the shot. Oh, what a goal! Schweinsteiger. Yes, lads. Oh my God! Perfect. What's up, boys, and welcome to the foot birthday, Schwein. I literally have like a dust ecosystem all across the bottom floor of my room. Welcome to the foot birthday, Bastian Schweinsteiger, featuring Podolski, aka the Schweindolski Squad Builder Episodia. Now we've got some other foot birthday cards in here. Uh, we've got some other informs. We put together a really, really good German side. But what we have here right now is the 88 rated foot birthday Bastian Schweinsteiger, which I was able to announce on Thursday, an hour before the official release. So again, just felt really, really privileged and just want to thank you guys for putting me in a position where I was able to do something really fun like that uh, with a player, or I should say for a player, that literally I've idolized uh, since I'm a little kid. My favorite player of all time, Bastian Schweinsteiger. We finally get his 88 rated card, which like I said in that video, is most likely a variation of his FIFA 13, FIFA 14, uh, 88 rated card, 65 pace, uh, 83 dribbling, 82 shooting. Well, as a matter of fact, we have the full stats right now, so we'll take a look at it. We've got the 82 attacking positioning, and the highest stat that we have, obviously by far, is that 98 composure. It looks like with these foot birthday cards, uh, the composure is one stat that a lot of them have a lot. Uh, that that a lot of them have a lot. We've got the 89 shot power and the 87 long shot, so we decided not to boost any of his shooting stats, which is why we put the engine chem style, give him a little bit more pace, some dribbling, some passing, um, even though he already has some crazy, crazy passing stats, but we do increase crossing and the rest of them uh, because that is a little bit low. What we're gonna try to do is get this Seaman Coleman card and see if we could possibly get that in this episode. We've got the Daryl Horgan, AKA the Irish Nep, uh, four out of 10. This is actually one we could possibly do. And then we've got the ninth anniversary. But speaking of David Myler, we've got it, bro. I've got a silver autographed David Myler card. I should just be able to submit this in the ultimate team and get it for free. Because this is a milestone epi, we had to splurge and put together an expensive full German squad episode here. We've got André Scherle, foot birthday André Scherle up top. We've got Poldi, who always has to be within one link of Schweinsteiger, left-footed. We're going to put him up there as our center forward, uh, as our right striker. We've got Marco Reus, who I spent 813,000 coins on. Last night, he is currently up to, I believe, or he's currently down to 780,000 coins, so we're going to lose a little bit on him. His stats are absolutely insane. 90 shot power, 91 long shots, 83 long passing, and then 90 short passing. Looks like he could actually be a very, very good cam, even though he has stats that could make him an insane striker. So we're going to see what we can do with him. We've got... Tony Klus, we spent 200k on him, we've got Leon Goretzka, we've got Schweini Kimmich, Jonathan Ta, we've got Ginter, we've got Plattenhardt, and then we've got Ter Stegen in Keeper, the team of the group stage, 89 rated. Now, like I said, boys, we have nine matches left to win in uh, in divisions in order to get that David Myler card, and then we also want to score one off the woodwork. Uh, Poldi's finishing is not great, which is one of the tricks to getting that one done. He's only got 82 finishing, so hopefully um, we'll be able to maybe bang a finesse or a long shot off the post, which just would really be great, would go 50% along the way of getting that one done. If not, we're just gonna have to grind a lot more games. I guess that's my question of the episode. Do you guys like this? I I personally love this entire concept of grinding games. I know it might take a little bit longer, but the concept of grinding games for a card that can unlock you another card. I just love that. I wish it was brought more often. I, I wish it was something that was like weekly. Like, I don't know. I don't know how they would do it, but maybe just colorful versions or special versions of the regular cards. Even if they weren't boosted, I would play towards a card if that meant I could unlock another card or play towards a card that you could possibly unlock. But anyway, boys, if you guys are hyped for the foot birthday Schweindolski episode, smash that like button. Let's try and crush 4,000 likes for an emotional Basti and Poldi episode. If you guys are new to the channel, don't forget to hit that subscribe button down below. We've got the fitness up. We've made sure that all the chem styles are correct. Let's get into match number one. Let's see if we get a little bit closer to that Rooney or Van Persie. Uh -huh. Match number one, he's got that Ibra, he's got that Laka, and he's got that KDB. Lukas Podolski, cheese party. Good to see it. Podolski! Lukas Podolski! Bro, that was one of the goals of the year right there! I'm gonna show they're running down the left flank just as he did in the World Cup final. And then Lukas Podolski uh -huh. with the volley of dreams in the top right hand corner. 90% of the time, even with like player of the month and high rated informs, so most of the time I sky that. Not 
with that proof missile. Two nil. And we are up 2-0 in the 20th minute. Now, question of the episode here. Uh, uh, we, we scored an absolutely incredible goal with Rooney yesterday. And I was about to ask... Uh, I was about to ask which one was more impressive, the Podolski one or the Rooney one. Now, from distance, the Rooney one, maybe. But that was against a really bad squad. You guys will remember. Uh, the guy's name was, like, uh, header, header goals or something like that. Uh, but this is a full tryhard squad. This is actually online divisions, which is the one that requires... Uh, this is actually the this is actually the online divisions uh, objective. So this is the one that actually requires skill. So you're probably not going to find a whole lot of people asking for uh, downward headers here. Uh huh. Good goal. Wow, bro, the timing on that pass had to be perfect. Even even 89 Ter Stegen's not gonna, he doesn't stand a chance against that. Boy's well, going in alone, it will be a brilliant goal. An absolute stunner Marco from Royce. Marco Royce. Marco Royce, cha cha cha. No. 3-1. I'm feeling pretty good in this match right now. What else is going on this weekend? We have uh, we have a few informs. Mohamed Salah had one of the craziest performances yesterday versus Watford. I think it was like four. I think it was pretty sure it was four goals. It was a 5-0 victory. Someone else scored. Uh, but Mohamed Salah is just doing methy thi uh, methy. Messy things in the Premier League. Mario Gomez, I think, got himself another two-goal match. Uh... I feel like he has to get an inform for that, but then again, they gave him one already, so not sure, uh, not sure how likely that is. Um, who else got themselves? Uh, who else had crazy, crazy performances? I'm trying to think. It was a pretty big weekend in the MLS. Wait for it. Baldy. Uh, seven shots, three on target, 54 percent possession. Marco Royce, Tony Cruz, and Lucas Podolski, the only guy that's not on the board yet, or obviously eight other players. Done deal. Four one. I don't know how much substance there is to this theory, but I have a theory that full national teams just play better. I don't know what it is. I don't know if I'm having just a lot more enjoyment playing with a full German side, or if it's the fact that maybe a full nationality team has some benefits that we don't know of. But anytime I play with a full nationality team, dude, I just feel like it gels so much more. We get a nine point four for Tony Cruz. He gets himself. Uh, he only gets himself a goal, but I guess he can pass it. Yeah, a lot of good, sixteen out of sixteen. Perfect passes, just like in real life. Um, and then we get ourselves two goals with Marco Royce. We get a goal with Poldy. And then we don't get an assist or a goal with Schweini. So what we're going to try in the next match, Royce at right striker and then Schweini at cam to see what his attacking, uh, to see what his attacking looks like. So that's what we're going to do in the next match. 13 shots, 7 on target. 4 shots, 3 on target for him. And we do a nice bit of damage to get ourselves that much closer to that David Myler, uh, St. Paddy's Day card. Let's get in match number two. Los Gates. You can tell this guy has been grinding because not only does he have himself yes, the green uh, Myler card, which I think is nine nine wins in division uh, in divisions, but he's got himself the St. Paddy's Day kit. So this is a guy that takes Ultimate Team very very seriously. Stop inviting me! Oh, we got a guy on the mic, dude. This it this better be worth getting on the mic for, bro, because I had to take my mitts off. this guy dude a destra eccolo il cross e testa di gol 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 hello got you gang got you gang got you gang got you gang why you mad bro match number 3 we're keeping it rolling here he's got another like i said he's got a Gabriel Jesus he's got that Serge Aurier Puerto Rico CF Boricua uh, Van Dijk, he's got Koscielny, he's got Baca, um, he's got himself Ederson, Kalas Minots, he's also got Fernandinho, and, uh, whew, okay, I think we can put the hat back on, we don't need to have this, 
plugged in anymore. All right, okay. Oh my god, I'm lucky not to be down 2 0. I deserve to be down 2 0 right now. Surely he's, he's too weak, dude. That's why he's going for 60k. He's way too weak. Surely, come on, make up for it, dude. Anderson! Finish him! Out! Six shots to be on target, 56% possession. I sort of don't want to change anything, but I think what we're going to do is we're going to put uh, Royce at right striker, Schweini at Cam. Podolski's got a left foot, doesn't have a great weak foot, so we're just going to keep him left, and then Clues can shoot with either. He's got the five-star weak foot. Let's see how this works out. Come on, boys. Hug it out. That was a that was a perfect, a perfect touch pass from Schweinsteiger. Come on, I'm a tactical genius. Let's go. Schweinsteiger with the game winner, possibly. Schweinsteiger with possibly the game winner, boys. Oh, Schweinsteiger, I knew, I knew we had to play McCam. He was asking me the entire last step. He was like, "Play, can I come spielen, bitte?" Woo! That is what I'm talking about, dude. And it feels great knowing that this could possibly be three. This could possibly be three wins that we get towards that Myler card. Sometimes an epi comes together so perfectly. I mean, let, let's talk about a couple things. Let's talk about a little bit of the subtext. You've got the Marco Royce coming back from an injury. Doing an incredible skill move to get away from that player. Passing it off to the left side to Andre Schürrle. Uh, one of the most famous passes of all time uh, from the World Cup from the left side, similar to that one. And then Bastian Schweinsteiger, foot birthday card, just got him and he manages to score possibly the game sealer, not even the game winner. Uh, the one that's just gonna make it impossible beyond a shadow of a doubt. Uh, for this guy to come back. 83rd minute. Man, 4 1. We're gonna get rage quit. Come on! Please tell me that we scored the Woodwork goal with Bastion Schweinsteiger. Oh my god, I think it went off the woodwork! I think that went off the woodwork, boys! In the 90th minute, in the last match, we get the hat trick with Schweini to possibly unlock ourselves that uh, Seaman Coleman. We get it, boys! We get the hat trick with Schweini! He gets the man of the match ball, he does an awesome handshake with the referee, and then we manage to get ourselves three wins in a row. 10.0, uh, he gets himself two assists and three goals in the third and final match. Emotional, uh, 5-1 victory. So we scored something like, I think we conceded something. Oh, we're gonna have to see, we're gonna have to see that last, we're gonna have to see that last goal in slow-mo. We're gonna have to see the last goal in slow-mo, dude, because this is too, no way. <gasps> Off the woodwork, please, please, please let that count. An online single. <laughs> We scored the Woodward goal and it's not going to count because it, it wasn't an online singles. Bro, come on, dude. I mean, yes, we're like, we're almost, we're, I guess we're, we're almost halfway to the Myler card. But bro, that would have been amazing. But we managed to do it, boys, with the Foot Birthday Squad. Three matches played. We cause a rage quit. We win big in the third and final match, 5-1. And we managed to get five goals and two assists 
with 88 rated foot birthday Bastian Schweinsteiger. Now, the episode in question, like I asked yesterday, which of the foot birthday SPCs have you guys unlocked? And then the other question of the FP I'm thinking about, uh, I'm torn, I'm in between two minds whether or not to do a foot birthday foot draft tomorrow or a Honda, a Kiyosake Honda foot birthday card because he does have 99 long shots, 96 shot power. Could be a crazy, crazy epi to do with a Liga MX side. Maybe I can figure out a way to get Schweini in there as well. But anyway, boys, that is going to be the Episodia. Hopefully you guys did enjoy. Really, again, thank you to EA for letting me announce that Bastian Schweinsteiger card. And thank you guys, as always, for the support on the channel. Just means the absolute world to me. And we get to do an emotional epi like this with that 88 rated foot birthday Basti Schweinsteiger. But anyway, boys, like I said, that is going to be the episode. If you did, hit... But anyway, boys, like I said, that is going to be the episode. If you guys did enjoy, hit that like button. If you guys are new to the channel, don't forget to hit that subscribe button down below. I will see you guys for another upload tomorrow. Till next time, boys. Tschüss. Later. Adeus.